Hello friends and my dear students, welcome back to my channel Phoenix Physics. Today we are going to learn resistivity. It is denoted by the symbol rho. In our previous video, we derived the formula for resistance that is R is equal to L by sigma into A. Here L is nothing but the length of the conductor, A is cross-sectional area of the conductor. Then what about sigma? Sigma is nothing but conductivity of the material. This conductivity of the material depends only on its type of the material used but not on its dimension. This is very very important. I have already studied resistivity in microscopic form of Ohm's law derivation part. What is resistivity? Simply we can say inverse of conductivity is known as resistivity or we can say the reciprocal of conductivity is equal to the resistivity of the material. Consider this as my equation 2 and this is my equation 1. Substitute equation 2 in 1. So R is equal to 1 by sigma is rho. So rho into L by A. This is equation 3. From this equation, we can say the resistance of the material is directly proportional to the length of the material and inversely proportional to the cross-sectional area. Here, suppose L is equal to 1 meter and A is equal to 1 meter square means substitute these two value in this equation 3. You can get R is equal to rho. Under this condition, the resistance is equal to resistivity of the material. Then how do you define the electrical resistivity of the material? The electrical resistivity is defined as the resistance offered to current flow by the conductor of unit length having unit area of cross section. This is the definition for resistivity. Why do we study resistivity? Based on the resistivity, we can classify the materials into three types. That is conductors, semiconductors and insulators. Conductors have lowest resistivity. Semiconductors have resistivity greater than conductors but less than the insulators. Here insulators have highest resistivity. Example for this conductor is copper and aluminium. See here we have 10 to the power of minus 8. Minus 8 that is why I said conductors have lowest resistivity. Insulators have highest resistivity. Example is pure water and glass. Here 2.5 into 10 to the power of plus 5. That is why I said insulators have highest resistivity. Example for semiconductor is silicon and germanium. Then SI unit is ohm meter. In this class we studied about electrical resistivity of the material. Electrical resistivity of the material is defined as the resistance offered to current flow by the conductor of unit length having unit area of cross section and the SI unit of resistivity is ohm meter. I hope this video is useful to you. If you like my video, please share and subscribe my video. Thank you.